Good morning guys, another beautiful morning, I'm just up, we had breakfast, same old breakfast really for me, I just had a few eggs and some pancakes, uh, and then I had an orange as well. Um, the plan for today is that we've got a training, uh, we've got to be down at the gym at 10, 10 a.m. I'm in the room with this other guy now, so I don't want to like make videos in there, because yeah, I don't really know him, he doesn't really speak English, so, you know, I don't want it to be like a bit awkward or something like that, I know you probably could understand that. So I just came down to the beach after breakfast. So just going for a little walk. So we're getting ready for that, I have to pick up my gear, and I'm not sure still yet if we have one or two trainings, so that's still something that I have to find out. It's hard to get so much footage while I'm out here because, you know, we're so busy with doing double days and, you know, don't want to get my camera out too much while I'm on trial, etc. So I'm just coming up with new, like, creative ways to make more content and to kind of get it out there. But it's quite nice walking along the beach to speak with you guys and keep in touch with how things are going. Uh... Yeah, yesterday's training was, was alright, it was a little bit difficult in tight spaces, but, you know, I think it's just all going to come down to, to the game, maybe, and maybe a few things with the language, I really don't know what they're going to say, because there is a language barrier here, it is difficult for me also, as I think it would be with the coaches, um, yeah, but the only reason is that I could think that they wouldn't want to offer me something is that the obvious language barrier because performance wise I'm doing well I'm feeling fit I'm good I've played well in the first game I'm already confident that I'll play well in the second game because I'm very consistent with what I do um, that's it so that's the only reason that I could think that they're not they wouldn't want to take me but We'll see what happens, because like I said, there's other things that come into play with uh, football clubs, maybe, yeah, the language, like I said, it's going to be difficult, um, and also, yeah, just mixing with the guys socially and, and things like that is also difficult, just because of the language, so, we'll see what happens, but I'm doing well here, I'm enjoying my time, so, that's, that's all I can really control, um, and just keep training good for the next, yeah, it's pretty much today and then tomorrow, really, so. So that's it, I'm going to go and get ready for training now, maybe take a little rest, do some meditation, get a coffee, and then head out. And so we go! Hey guys, just checking in after the first training. We just had training and I went straight to straight to lunch. We have a second training later this evening. So I'm just chilling out till then. I'm actually just sitting outside, drinking some coffee, chilling out, relaxing. I could potentially go for a little rest, but I'm not sure yet. Uh, the first training today, we just did a little bit of, yeah, we did quite a long warm up actually. And then we did some like, defensive movement and the shape that they want to kind of play. Uh, I'm not going to go into further details about that because that's that's kind of private to the team and I don't want to interfere and make that you know public but it's quite good to be able to move in the shape. I was a little bit out of my position uh, in the movement so you know I was looking uh, at the other person who was playing in the position that I'm probably looking at so it's just good to go into tomorrow with that. I think this evening will be, be quite light with some set pieces, etc. And getting ready for that game tomorrow. I'm still not sure who it's against, but you know, I'm, I'm feeling quite good and I'm feeling ready, so we'll see what happens there. Like I said this morning, uh, I get a decision after that game about what they want to look at further. 
so yeah we'll see what happens I still haven't made a decision 100% on my side either with what I want to do I'm hearing back from a few other options and places so we'll just keep in touch and I'll let you guys know what's coming up when things are a little bit more concrete but I'm here now I'm making the most of it enjoying it also and yeah just glad I came really to experience it as well great experience here and just to be chilling out in this beautiful place a bit warmer weather I've actually got shorts on today so that's it's good um, yeah that's about it I'll get in touch with you guys a bit later and let you guys know how the second session was and what I've been up to Hey guys, I've uh, decided not to do the two minute coffee talk today actually because yeah I just got a little bit late uh, for time, I was running out of time for to go to training today so you know I'm just here after the second training today, we were just doing a lot of position work and a few attacking moves to kind of get ready for tomorrow. It was quite, quite a lot of running actually to be honest so that's a little bit fatiguing but you know, I'm just super proud of the work that I did during the off-season and feeling really fit and strong. Uh, I think as well what makes the difference is kind of the mindset that, that I have and had coming in here was just to keep really positive and to make the most of the experience and just to not stress so much because that's when you start coming into the emotional part of the brain and when you're training and playing on, on trial you especially you want to be going into the computer part of your brain and just be firing the firing the, firing the circuits so that you're just having nothing in the way of that that's when you're going to play the best and and like be in a flow state they call it being in the pocket uh that's 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 the mindset that you want to have and the mentality going into things and i always find the best to do that is to relax not have any pressure and then it's just working you know obviously sometimes pressure is good but you want to make that to positive pressure and not negative where you're just going to be all emotional and all up in your mind and stressed and rushed and that's not working well so that's what I wanted to say a little bit just to keep super positive in everything you're doing and to have that confidence that you can do what you want like you're coming into new places you're experiencing new things you can either, like, it's quite a normal human experience, I think, of, you know, like, fight or flight or freeze. So, you either got to come in and fight for that place. <laughs> like, that's that's the way you got to do it because there's no other way. You don't, like, you're either in or you're out. And you've got to have that mentality that a good friend of mine said a long time ago. His name's Sean Morris. Uh... He said that you've got to have that mentality that you're coming in and taking the food off that person's plate. And that's literally what it is. You want to have that salary that they're earning, be in the team, have their position, and you just got to be just as ruthless as that. So that's just my thoughts tonight. And, you know, if you have any, any suggestions or any thoughts more about that subject, chuck, chuck it in the comments below. Um... Yeah, and if you liked the video, give me a big thumbs up and a subscribe for more content. Thank you very much. I'm just going to head to bed now. So, peace, love, and ciao.